Hello dreamers! Woo! Good afternoon! Medyo hapon na at nagmamadali ako kasi I woke up late mga 11 ako na gising and I had to talk to the school and do a lot of stuff so right now I'm running to the uh, Service Canada office to get a social insurance number so lalakad ako and outside pwede ka nang hindi mag wear ng mask so come Friday also um, there will be a, a, a one step higher so I think we will be like level 3 by that time so which means that uh, restaurants can accept dine-in even on the inside like the enclosed space inside because right now they can only accept dine-in customers if they have a patio like the outside al fresco and one so I need to go and hurry first to get my scene I hope I can make it in time because they're gonna close at 4 p.m. and <laughs> yeah laugh at me because it's already 3 <laughs> I better run huh? see you later So, I'm here at the streetcars, they call it. Hi, it's the first time to ride a streetcar. And there's a machine where if you don't have a card yet, there's a machine that you can use and pay over here. And I'm on my way to, um, to, my, to the place where I should be going. You have to wear a mask if you're in a streetcar. And uh, let's wait as we reach the school. Please look right for traffic when exiting. Please look right for traffic when exiting. Queen's Park and University of Toronto. Grab and look. It's at Queen's Park. Oh, it's so nice. Next stop, McCall Street. Okay, so Tapos na akong kumuha ng uh, SIN or Social Insurance Number. Um, hindi na ako vi nakavideo kanina kasi I was running out, out of time. So, dumiretso na ako. And then, right now, I'm trying to check. Mabilis lang. Um, what they asked for me was my password, passport, uh, my study permit, and my mobile number. So, kahapon, kasama ko si Kuya Jed, I got my mobile number. Um, plan, pero hindi no contract siya, every month lang naman siya. And then, so I already have that done. My scene, and tomorrow I'll be opening a bank account because tomorrow's my appointment. So I'm gonna go and walk back. Naglalakad na lang ako, mga 40 minutes lang naman. Kasi also to get familiarized with many other things here on this side of a uh, college street so mabilis lang naman ang ano mabilis lang yung appointment I, I mean ang process kasi pa, pa close na rin sila so wala na rin tao so I was like I'm, I'm safe 
ay naulog tapos di na ako sasakay ng ano maglalakad na lang ako <laughs> to save money hindi na ako magsasakay ng street car kasi I also need to do the exercise wala naman akong uh, din parang mamadali I'm not in a hurry so I'm just gonna go and walk even if it's hot and uh, try to see and get familiarized with uh, many other uh, many other things here in this side of College Street so it's College Street is a very long stretch of an of a street so you know let's enjoy muna tayo as we are new to this beautiful city okay okay so that's this is the University of Toronto over here parang may na graduate <laughs> on that side and up to the end over there so I'm still walking I still have to walk for about one to two kilometers I think to reach my place and also buy some stuff uh, groceries for a dinner and yeah, so this is a street car this is how it would look like it's a street lang siya. like technically it's a street lang siya. people would just come there and go and take get up Pwede naman mo streetcar kasi medyo mahal siya. Tapos malapit lang din naman. You can just walk and then exercise. And save something. So, continue muna ako ng walking. Mga 30 minutes pa. So, I'm here at Queen's Park. Kasi naman mga maganda na ng background natin, oh. Let's check the whole park. And then, ato. And this is Tara, uh, Ontario, Ontario Power Generation. Building a lot. And while everyone is walking, I need to take a break, cause. <sighs> Pagod maglakad. Sana pumayat na ako. <laughs> Pwede ka din dito mag-scooter. Mga pipi boys! Aray! Kayo ha! Maya, manda kayo. Charot. Ay. Nasaya siya. Kailangan ko nga lang mag-grocery. Ah, malaki pala yung Queen's Park and then there's like a big Don't like a big building maybe. Ano ko na ba yan? I need to read more about this. So there's a Nelson Mandela Boulevard. Ay, may ganun. This is a University Avenue. Going to that side. Ano may mga kalapate. Doon, going to Hilton. Ah, University Avenue pala to. Sinyan kami always dumadaan papunta doon sa hotel ni Kuya Jed. So, let's go and cross the street. Pa, 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 pa. Four, three, two, one level up level up level up level up level up I'm sorry it's a baby oh smile sha and then we're going to the downtown area like the real downtown like core it's a core 
for this side of the ano tapos padadaan na natin ang aming school katabi lang siya ng police station so kapag uh, magkakating classes ako hello police station charot so ito yung sign ng ano nila subway yan nakalagay TTC Toronto Transportation Commission so yan yung sign ng subway nila tsaka streetcar tsaka bus so it's not very busy visible so you have to pay attention pag maghanap ka ng next stop although it's relatively available online naman if you use google maps and walk you can easily check it out and then this is the Toronto General Hospital ganda ng building nila So one thing I've noticed, pala, it's like this. When they do, uh, how do you call it, demolition and construction of buildings, they're really very of high quality standards. Because I normally see that, um, pati yung walkway, pathway, they need to create a, a temporary walk that's covered and that would keep the people that's walking from from any accidents or um, debris debris says that's falling down so this debris and all it should be properly followed so may iba naman na nagumagamit sila ng net diba if you can see or you you get to experience that or to check that out sa mga places ninyo yung, yung iba they're using nets they're using nets as to to catch whatever it is that might fall from from, uh, from uh, or caused by the the ongoing construction of activities so that would uh, keep the uh, the pedestrian the public from getting involved into an accident so diba may cover talaga lahat and then pati yung mga workers may mga railings para safe din sila when they do the job uh, the reason why I'm sharing that kasi ano I, uh, I have this friend uh, that I always uh, we always discuss things like that like things that would involve uh, occupational safety and health and he used to do training for um whatever how do you call it um he used to do um occupational safety and health training before I think even right now, pero online siguro. So he is uh, accredited or trained by the Department of Labor and, and Employment with regards to OSH, OSH, we call it OSH, Occupational Safety and Health, sa mga workers natin dyan sa Pilipinas. So I, uh, I also have, uh, I have two licenses kasi in the Philippines, so I can actually use it to apply for a uh, trainer's accreditation to also do the same training for occupational safety and health yun ang sabi ng uh, isang friend ko so we always discuss that whenever we, when, when we go to like Manila and Singapore and Bali and we get to see that so that's one of the things that we always um, observe also our, our keen minds our uh, uh, observant uh, eyes then we would start discussing about this about how 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 safety it is for the workers kasi mostly sa atin yun naman mostly but meron marami sa atin diba parang they don't really follow all the necessary construction occupational safety and health and hazard parang ganon so, so to show how these companies the corporations or the construction company that is actually doing it it would show how competent they are uh, in dealing with or in protecting their workers from potential danger uh, because of this uh, work related activities so in just so nakita ko dito they're very safe napansin ko naman of course this is Canada but I just want to share that kasi um 
But at least malaman niyo in the future or when you get the chance, malaman niyo na um, our workers need to be protected. Our workers need to be protected also, even if hindi naman siya even if kasi sa atin naman kasi nilalang lang natin yung mga like um, labor intensive workforce like yung mga construction workers so kahit yun siya they deserve uh, equal opportunity to be safe from uh, occupational hazard and danger so yun, you should always tell them para hindi naman din mano yung ano nila their hindi ma jeopardize or hindi ma-compromise yung uh, safety and security nila. So, I'm still here. Sorry sa mga check, ah. <laughs> This is 101 College Street, still the Toronto General Hospital. So, I need to continue walking muna. Hello. So, I ordered ako ng iced americano and I'm here at the College Park. So, yeah. It's like a park within the vicinity. And sit there pwede makapag-rest if you wanted to rest and you know, sit down and grab a bite kasi dito if you can see, some people would come here to, like, you know... Magre rest at magre relax. So, ako naman, it's still very hot, so hindi muna ako maglalakad. Press muna and, uh, and coffee to energize me up until the evening para di na nakagutumin. So I'm drinking black coffee to stop my uh, anong tawag dun? to suppress my cravings para hindi ako mag-crave ng something ano. So this is black or dark as they say it. Um, or Americano in Starbucks it's called Americano meaning it says pure coffee uh, no sugar, no creamer it's uh, black coffee. Kasi iba kasi pag black coffee nilalagyan ng sugar. Hindi naman yung dapat nilalagyan ng sugar. It says, if you say black, black coffee or Americano, it's always just pure coffee. It could be ice, it could, it could be hot. So ako in the morning, I do it hot. And then in the afternoon, if magkakape ako or not, but, uh, or I mean, if magkakape ako, I would uh, prefer iced, iced coffee. Para ma-minimize din naman. Kailangan ko kasi mag-lose ng weight kasi ang laki ng chan ko. So I need to, I need to work hard to, to get rid of this big uh, beer belly. So I feel accomplished today. Nakapapoint pa na ako for my bank account tomorrow. And I already got my scene. And I need to buy some stuff para sa room. Lalagyan ng mga ball pen, ganun, mga markers. Punta ko ng Dollarama. It's like a cheap, cheap store. Para siyang, na, uh, para siyang Daiso. Parang Daiso shards. Dollarama. Dito. And uh, may mga Pilipina. Uh, after that, I hope that I will already, um, I'm already enrolled para makapag-start na ako tomorrow. It's been three days already since Monday, pero wala pa silang nagagawa. There's no progress coming from their end. Medyo nakakainis siya, but anyhow, you just have to wait for them. I'm, I need to make them to make a call tomorrow. Just to make sure. Okay? So, uh, relax lang muna ako sandali. Pagkain naman ni Auntie yung ano eh. Bawal ba pakainin. Pinapakain niya pero...
Anti, bawal ipa kainin anti. May parang brown din na ano, oh. may brown oh, di ba? May brown na kalapat eh. Ano mga ganon. Sige, kain. Pak, ay! Dito mother <laughs> Yung mga ibang ibon walang magawa yung mga maliliit The smaller ones oh Yan you try to keep up girl Wala na <clears throat> Dito come here Come here Kung magtay kayo ha, sa paling ko kayo. Hmm, siya lang ata nag-iisang brown. May puti din o. Oh. Albay na ba yun? Is that allowed, right? Nagalit. <laughs> Ikaw dito. Oh, di ba may puti na oh, ano? Ay kalabati pa, hindi pa ito uwak. Oh, pinagalitan na siya kasi bawal nga, pero it's okay. Come here. Ah, lapet ke lapet. Hmm, lapis lah saya kan. Kalau ni lah, ada makanan aku. Walau aku makanan. No, it's a Frank. Ay, 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 ay. Ah, di bawah. Very. Oh. Ay, ay, ito namang isa. Wala. Huwag ha. Go, go. Oh, yeah. Wow, ang sweet. Marami na akong friends. Hi. Ay, ay. Bilis ha. Guru, hi best friend. Hanapan mo ko ng afam ha. Go. Hanapan ko afam. Go. 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 Over here. Kru. Ula na. Waka mag-iti ka sa aking shoes ha. Waka mag-iti sa aking shoes. Very friendly naman sila. It's a prank. Ah, dito. Lipad, lipad. Walang nilipad dito. Kru. parang manok mga manok lang pala yun <laughs> come here <laughs> pag ganito ang kamay ko maraming mas come oh lapit siya oh 
Let's come, ka. Oh, let's see brown. Let's see brown. Grrr. Grrr. Oh, ay. <laughs> let's come, siya. <laughs> Dito. Dito. Grrr. 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 Ang sige. Grrr. Let's come si Brown. Na Brown na kalapate. Grrr. Grrr. So tingin, -tingin siya oh. Totoo ba talaga to? Totoo ba talaga to? Or chin scammer tong baklang to ah? Na-scam ka? Ay! Scammer siya no? It's a Frank! It's a, it's, a it's a prank pala. It's a prank. Come here. Sige na. Mm -hmm. Come here. Come here. Mm -hmm. Come here. 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 Ano dili para na sila. Para sila alis na kayo. Hmm. Okay. Hi, it's already 6 p.m. So I had a good read on sa ano sa College Park. And right now I'm on my way back home. In College Park. And the shop. Biona, like, you know, sit down and uh, have a relaxing uh, read or look at the people. The young bicycles for rent. Nasa $7 per 24 hours, yung rental niya. So I'm here now at Yong Street. Tuli tuli ako dapat, kasi I need to go to Freshco and buy some um, like food, super chicken and egg. Para makaluto ako ng egg for for me for dinner also. So maglalakad ako doon, kasi walang pedestrian lane. Doon ako sa corner. Aray, hi! Si baby, oi! Aray ko! <laughs> so, this road is under construct. Ito siya. So, yun. There's winners here. There's the brick. The brick. This is where the company where Kuya Jed is working or connected with. Mga mga gandang, uh, furniture, many others. So, under construction pa yung kanilang uh, road over here. And while well, I'm also walking, going to Fresh, Fresh Kobayon, I forgot. This is also a very big, you know, this place is a very big um, mall, shopping with retail shops and all. So the sun is still shining so bright at 6 p.m. Normally, it's mga 8 or 9 p.m. It's sunset dito. So I'm gonna go and continue walking muna. So I'm here at uh, Yong and Wellesley intersection so I need to go to Wellesley area and hopefully hmm? may marijuana hmm? ah, nabis na sila ah. para bili ako ng pagkain do grocery muna shortly and then continue cleaning up my room and 
decorating it a little bit or try and make it personalized I think so yung subway nila dito the signs are not really as big as the ones in Singapore or sa ibang lugar ito lang siya so you just have to look for that TTC logo so that uh, you'll be a little bit familiar with the place Ganon. and so I'm close to my place already just need to go to Fresh go down. Fresh go is my friend and roommate ko to get some fresh food. Nakalbo na. Whew. Well, this is already part of the village. Sintinitirhan ko is very is one street. Actually, considered part pa siya ng uh, ng uh, gay district or the LGBT area and. Even the bank, because it's just lang ng uh, pride. Even the bank, like has all these uh, LGBT colors. So this is called the village. Wow. So my this is called the village. So this is like a collection of uh, a lot of uh, several streets around here that is colorful and with all the with all the Tagdun rainbow colors so on the Duna side yung, there's like a rainbow pedestrian so this is like a very happy neighborhood okay gay friendly of course lalakad muna tayo si baby hi baby hi need to shape my ano na mamaya pag uwi need to go first